access granted. Hello there, YouTube. Today I want to show you guys the best, or not the best, but my recommendation for setting uh, OBS on the encoder side for live streaming. So you can look at this girl here while I, while I bring up the options or settings. Uh, menu, I think you will call it. All the non-important things I will just keep up for a minute and you can like take a look at it. So this is based on just general tab, streaming, where you want to stream, blah blah. Output. So this is the uh, the one with the encoder and what have you not. I have mine outscaled to like 6, oh what is it, 11,052 and 648. I get a good feedback for that, and then my bitrate is 21100. And then I have all these settings down here you guys can look at. See, the reason why I am going with a low resolution and low bitrate is because you can reach the most amount of people. That's being said, the longer way people are going from you, like let's say you are in Russia, or in Denmark in, in my case, and you are streaming. People in, in, in Denmark can uh, watch your stream if you bump it up to like the maximum, I think it's 720 and 2800 to 3200 is like the recommendation and 30 FPS. But the longer way you get from basically what server you're streaming to, people will start getting troubles and also people with like um, low bandwidth devices like uh, tablets, uh, old phones and all that and if they are like out where they don't have a great coverage and what have you not and people in poor countries with, 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 with really poor internet and all that so you start to get trouble so to read the most amount of people you need to lower this bitrate to, to around 1800 to 2100 and you can still go up to 720 I, I'm just doing this because it works for me and people st still think that I'm streaming in 720 so <laughs> I, I do that um, yeah the, it, it's basically just like I said it, it's until you get that little um, source button or source button on source button on your stream where people can automatically set it down to mobile devices and all that. If you want to reach people in, in, in like countries far away and in if you're living in EU you want to reach the American crowd or the Australians and the other way around, this is like a must. Um, the only streams I can watch in Denmark on, on the highest recommended uh, bit rate without buffering are partner streams without turning them down or streamers that have over around 3000 followers and it has something to do with the priority system on Twitch servers and all that technical shit so, so if I watch like a low followed streamer I think let's call it that like a, a new streamer on the peak times, that has also something to do with it, but let, let's say like on the peak times where most people are streaming, I can't watch them if they go just 50 bit or 2100. It will buffer all the time and what have you or not. And, and that's why I'm keeping mine here, because then I can reach the, the most amount of people uh, around the world. And of course you can set up your audio tracks and what have you or not here. Um, you need a default speaker, so I just have mine on my UBS device, my um, OB, uh, USB mixer, and this one here is my microphone. And th that gives you like two sources of, of uh, audio. And this is like the video output scale. Frames per second. Hot keys you can set up, and, and the advanced tab. I don't mess around with the advanced tab at all. You could put on Steam Delay, but I have not had problems with it. But if you're like a... Uh, have problems with stream snipers, yeah, you can do that. But yeah, basically what I want to evaluate uh, and, and 
really get into your guys' heads are uh, this little bit weight thing here. You could go like with CIF and variable bit weight and all that. All of these, like ABR, VBR, and CIF, I have had people complaining about buffering for some weird reason. The only one that I have not had so much problem with is this one here. There will always be people that will have buffering just because they have a shitty computer or something like that, but this is like the go-to thing and my landlord is mowing the fucking lawn now, so I have to stop. But anyway, I hope this will help you guys and have a nice day, man.